guys and welcome back to another video now today's video will be showing you this like it's a, something i've seen on instagram it's like a new instagram trend it's the floral eyeliner look um so i've done that but i've also put my own spin and touch on it for you guys um just to make it a little bit more wearable um if you want but anyway I will be using a mixture of products um, in this video I'm just gonna speed through my face makeup for you guys you've seen it so many times you don't need me to run through it and um, you can just check out my old videos if you want to know what I use and um, how I do it but some of the products are new as well so um, I will do a review of those products in a, another video for you guys, probably my next video for you guys. Um, so yeah, if you want to see how I created this look, it's like a very summery look. I quite like it. Um, then keep watching. I've moved my camera closer to me so you can kind of see what I'm doing um, because I'm on my phone and I've got it like selfie mode I can't like zoom right in for you guys um, so we'll just have to see I will try my best now I don't own scotch tape um, I'm like the sort of person that will use other stuff as alternatives. Does that make sense? So, today I'm using some masking tape I found from my art supply from college. Um, and I'm just going to use it as like scotch tape. So I'm just going to line it up where I want it to sit this will help me so much with my eyeliner and i know it looks weird and it looks like completely out of the ordinary to have like masking tape attached to your face but you know the things we do to look half decent or to try new things um i'm trying to get it so it doesn't jab me in the eye like so now i am going to be using a mixture of products for this like drugstore and high end um we'll just sit like this for a little while there we go now i look really weird right now but oh yeah so anyway i'm going to be using a mixture of drugstore and high end stuff for this look um, just because it's going to make my life easier, basically. So, the first, I'm going to do normal eyeshadow for this look. 
as well even though we're focusing on eyeliner um i just want to kind of create some sort of effect on my lids and creasing all of that malarkey um just so it's not just eyeliner but anyway so i'm gonna go in with this new urban decay naked ultimate basics palette got it through the post the other day so you guys won't have seen me use this yet but i'm taking the shade blow mixed with the shade nudie and i'm just gonna create that as my transitional color And then I'm going in with the shade Extra Bitter. Love this shade. And just going to put that in my crease. I absolutely love the shades in this palette. Purely because I have like really dark eyes and they go really well with my eye colour. And then I'm going to go in with the shade Lockout, just to darken that corner bit of my crease up. And I'm just going to pull that all out, all those colours out to create a really big winged type effect. Now, actually, I'm going to take these off and put fresh ones on for my eyeliner, just because I want that look. Um, I'm also then going to go in with my concealer and just kind of create a cut crease type effect. So I've just put fresh tape on, I've just positioned it slightly lower than the original tape I had on just because I want a decent eyeliner effect um, and then I am going to go in with this little really tiny brush, it's just a very small like detailing brush and I'm actually using lipstick for this because I don't have like coloured uh, well I, I have blue coloured eyeliner and that's it um, so I'm going to go in with like different shades um, for this one so I'm just going to find all the shades that I want to use for this look I have so many right I've got quite a few I don't know if I'm going to use all of them but we'll see so I'm going to start with the darkest shade uh, and for this one I'm going to use my little one so I'm going to use Kylie's Leo for this one the uh, matte liquid lipstick I'm just going to take a very small amount on my brush 
just start to create like little flowers I don't know how best to describe this so I'm just going to say little flowers and get on with it I've done like little tiny um, flowers in Leo then I am going to go in with the shade Court K just to add some purple tones to it added in like little hints of purple and then I am going in with exposed again by Kylie it's just a very pale pinky color just to add some lighter flowers like so and I'm just going to remove this tape now and you should end up with something like this now I know one of my wings is longer and it's weird but anyway then I'm going to be taking a black eyeliner and I'm just going to line underneath it um, just to make it stand out a little bit more. Like so.
I'm just going to clean it up as well with a makeup wipe um, just to create like a straight So, and then to create like the little centre pieces that flowers have, I'm going in with a metallic gold eyeliner and just going to put those centre pieces in. Put a lick of mascara on. So I'm going to dip into my new uh, Kylie Cosmetics um, collection. It's the Kim Kardashian West one. And I am going to use the shade Kiki. Now, I actually haven't tried all of these on. Um, it literally came in the post today. So, yeah. But I'm going to put on Kiki. <laughs> that's it for this video guys please don't forget to give it a thumbs up comment down below share and subscribe all the products that i have used will be listed in the description down below along with all of my social media and i will see you in my next video bye guys